Here is question 9 to get you started with calculus. And we are trying to rationalize the denominator of the given function. The, the function is x minus 8 divided by cube root of x minus 2. Now, rationalization of numerator or denominator or both is very important to understand before you get into calculus, right? We have a playlist which is going to help you with that. And this is a very typical example. This is kind of difficult and most students have not yet done a question like this. Normally you rationalize with just a square root, right? And you use the formula that a square minus b square equals to a plus b times a minus b, right? And in those cases you rationalize with the conjugate and get the answer. Well, what should you do for the cubes? For the cubes, you have to do or apply difference of cubes, right? So do you remember a cube minus b cube formula? That is a must to remember, right? So it's a minus b times a square plus a b plus b square. So that is the formula which you should remember to rationalize cubes or difference of cubes. Well, as far as the cubes are concerned, you could also rationalize sum of cubes. If we have a cube plus b cube, in that case, it is a plus b times a square minus a b plus b square, correct? So, both difference of cubes or sum of cubes can be rationalized with the technique I'm just going to show you. So, so that's the point to understand before we really get into it, right? I think most of you are very conversant with this simpler technique where you use a square minus b square. Now let's do this with cubes, right? So the given function is x minus 8 over cube root of x minus 2. So to rationalize it, we should multiply not with cube root x plus 2. That is a huge mistake which some students will do, right? We need to multiply this with, think this is a for you, right? And this is b for you. So in that case, like think this is like a minus b, right? So we need to write here a square plus ab plus b square to rationalize this. Now square of this will be Q, we write x squared. You see that? So we are writing square of this plus ab. That means 2 times cube root of x. That is ab, right? Plus b squared, which is 4, 2 squared. Divided by the same thing. So we will divide by cube root of x squared plus 2 times cube root of x plus 4. Now, now, look at this formula. a minus b times a square plus ab plus b square should give you what? a cube minus b cube. Now, what is cube of this? So, so one thing, another thing which you need to remember is you need to expand the part being rationalized. So, we have done all this so that we get rid of this cube root, right? So let's expand that denominator part. In denominator, we are going to get a cube minus b cube. So cube of this is x. So we get x minus cube of 2, which is 8. Do you see that? So that becomes your denominator. And you don't have to expand the numerator. Idea is to cancel out this common factor. So we will write x minus 8 and we'll multiply by all this, right? So all this is cube root of x squared plus 2 times cube root of x plus 4, right? And now we can cancel this to simplify and we get our result. After rationalization, we get this equal to cube root of x square plus 2 times 
cube root of x plus 4. So that is the result after rationalization, correct? So, so the students who find this difficult or they are not very fresh with it, I will recommend you to look into the playlist where we have a couple of examples of rationalizing numerator and or denominator. Thank you and all the best.